People of my generation, uh, we were kind of considered pioneers in the organic movement. Uh, I think it's now time to shift our focus to trying to pass on the knowledge that we have acquired. The TND Willie Farm's really been crucial for us since our start. You know, we purchased their CSA business to get Ubi off the ground and get started. We transferred the ownership of that business to Food Commons almost two years ago, and then the relationship just continued to evolve into assuming control of the farm as well. I started farming with my father in the Azores, Portugal, and, and then when I came to the U.S., I got a, a degree from crop science from Cal Poly and, and just built uh, my knowledge over my lifetime. It's all I've ever done is farm. Uh, you know, we'll continue, as Tom did, to modernize the farm. You know, the techniques and technology to do it are evolving, and it's our job to keep up with those to uh, do the best job that we can. The, the change for our customers is that with us having direct control of a farm, we can do production planning and um, work with specific customers that might want a product for us to grow. Food Commons Fresno is a very fresh idea. Um, all the people involved are committed to a lot of the principles and the service to community that TND Willie Farms was throughout our history. We've tried to continue on those relationships and build a more robust customer service model as well. As farms are looking to retire or looking for a transition plan, we want to be a viable option that local farmers will trust. You know, and the Food Commons folks have been very cooperative. They're very excited about this startup and uh, it's great to work with people that are interested in doing something good. It's the most productive agriculture region on the face of the earth. And I've enjoyed the privilege of, uh, of farming here for 40-some for years, very much so.